Hey, Northgate family. Welcome to another edition of the vlog. You know, the book of Proverbs is full of very wise sayings. That's why they call it the book of wisdom is because these little sayings teach you important truths. Proverbs 13 and verse 12 says this, hope deferred makes the heart sick. And often that can give us insight as to what's really going on. Sometimes we have those days where we just feel really bad, bummed, depressed, not like, what are we gonna do? It's because we had our hope in something else. And so if you're feeling depressed, sick, or like sad, you need to start asking yourself, what am I thinking about? What's going on in my mind? Have I been hoping in something that didn't come to fruition? We need to set our hope on Jesus, the author and perfect of our faith, the same. His loving kindness is consistent and true. New mercies we get to capture every day. Just want to encourage you to consider, what do you hope in? I got four things I want to talk to you about. First of all would be pastor's appreciation was October. I totally missed this one, and I just want to express how much I appreciate the pastoral staff. Pastor Ricardo, Pastor Houston, Pastor Michael, even our student internship, intern Pastor Zach. It's just been such an incredible team, a great team of people. We are blessed at Northgate. Such an incredible group of men. <clears throat> and I simply want to say uh, to you publicly how much I appreciate it. I hope you understand the value of these guys that give and invest and care and share their lives and, uh, and keep us on track with the heart of God. Second of all, I want to just let you know that we are working on a text messaging and we want you to be able to opt in or out of that and not get hit with something you didn't want. And so as we release, there will be an email soon about that. And I want you to be able to respond. Text messaging will be really, really helpful. For example, this coming Sunday, we're going to have church outside. That's the way it's just going to be until it's either too cold or raining or we get allowed to go back in the building. How are you going to know whether we're going to be having it outside or not? Sign up for text because with a single text, we can say, hey, it's raining or it's only 40 degrees and windy. We're not going to have church because we can't come inside. This will be very, very valuable and we're not going to abuse it, but it will give us a quick way in such a fluid time. It's just so crazy how this is all bouncing around. So text messaging, we want you to know it's coming and to be able to opt in or out of it uh, so that you can be a part of the Northgate family. Um, <clears throat> we are having church on Sunday mornings. It would be really helpful if some of you would come 15 to 30 minutes ahead of time and help us set up the pop-up uh, structures and uh, prepare the worship team, the band, and get things together for those who come. It's just nice to have community and be able to work together side by side as well as when it's over. Maybe you can't come early, but you can stay afterwards and you can help us take things down and put things away. Uh, as this season in our life, church is outside. Did you know five years ago this Sunday to the very day, it was November 8th, 2015, when we had our first service in the facility. Five year anniversary this Sunday. I hope you come and I know we won't be inside, but you can be outside with us in the building. That'd be really great. Last of all, ladies, this is the week for your um, women's retreat. So that is coming up on the 12th and the 13th. So please um, sign up, let us know, send me an email or a text so that I can get you squared away with the information needed uh, for the women's retreat. The speaker is uh, very dynamic. She'll be speaking out of the book of es Esther. And uh, there's uh, um, quite a bit that they've been planning for you. So ladies, do join that. The cost is only $10. If that's a problem, please let me know. And we'll see what we can do for you. Hey, I look forward to seeing you guys on Sunday. It's going to be beautiful. 65 degrees, and I'm praying there won't be any rain. It'll just be clouds. You might even need to bring a jacket or an umbrella. Have a good week. Bye.